Hey, what is going on everybody? I kind of wanted to do something a little different today. We're going to be playing Metal Gear Solid 5 Ground Zeroes. Um, this came out a while back and it's not really a full game. It's, uh, it's considered like a, uh, like a prequel to the main game that's coming up, uh, Phantom Pain. <clears throat> but anyways, I wanted to show you all uh, you know, pretty much the entire uh, story mission in this game, and I'm gonna try to do it getting a S rank. I've done it before, but I thought I'd put a video up, and plus I, you know, show you all how awesome the game looks at 1080p, 60 frames per second. <clears throat> so let's just get into it. I have to do all this crap. And here we go. I'm not going to do it on hard because I still, I'll, I'll probably fail on hard because I haven't even, I don't think I've tried it in hard since like uh, when it came out. But whenever I get around to doing, or at least trying it out, uh, maybe I'll put a video up of that if you all want to see. Anyways, let's just get into this. And I'll be quiet so y'all can enjoy the cutscenes and all that. <clears throat> and I'll probably won't be talking a lot in this video. So, might even turn the game volume up a little bit. And here we go. Told us everything. Don't worry, I kept my word. She didn't suffer long. Here. You earned it. How's it feel to play the traitor? No more war games. You're a real man now, soldier. Give my regards to your boss when you get home.
Ten days ago, we got reports that Pass was still alive. She survived. She was rescued by a Belizean fisherman who found her drifting in the Caribbean. So what's the plan? Silence her before we're compromised? No. I've got something else in mind. Our friends at Cypher suspect Pass could be a double agent. She's being held for interrogation at a camp on the southern tip of Cuba. Black site. Nice. A slice of American pie on communist soil and out of U.S. legal jurisdiction. The upcoming inspection of Mother Base has to be connected somehow. The timing's too perfect. The UN's nuclear inspection. My guess is they're trying to corroborate Pass's leak. What an army without a nation. Word of our capabilities gets out, and we'll have the whole world out to shut us down. Having an American private intelligence agency involved is bad news. Cypher's the ones who sent Paz to us in the first place. She knows their true nature. Right. Paz is our only link to Cypher. If she's still alive, we need her on our side. Who's the other target? That would be Chico. He's being held in the same area as Paz. Last radio contact was 40 hours ago. Find them both. Bring him back alive. Enter the compound from the south cliff. Secure Chico and Paz, then report back from the rendezvous point. Send a chopper from across the Cuban border. You should be back at Mother Base in time for lunch. You'll probably just miss our guests. The only catch is you go in solo. The politically sensitive nature of the mission means backup is not an option. Fine. I like some alone time now and then.
the compound. Get inside and head northeast. All right, here we go. This is an infiltration mission. You've got to stay out of sight. Before you go any further, use your binoculars to recon the area. All of the Keep things on. that were there right now, they're not going to be there. On the pause screen. Your first if time. You ready your weapon while crawling. You can move horizontally left or right. If you do that holding the dash button, you'll move faster. What do you see? Press the call button to get more intel. Your binoculars are equipped with a directional microphone. You should be able to listen in on whatever they're pointed at. It's a guard. Don't let him see you. Avoid combat whenever possible. or go around. What do you think? A searchlight. Stay out of the beam or the guard will spot you. There's a guard up there. If you're going to eliminate him, use a gun. There's the prison, full of enemy combatants abducted from around the world. Now head east to the old prison area. You can bring up the target's location on your iDroid. Take a good look at the enemy through your binoculars, and you can mark him. Marked enemies can be sensed when nearby, even if there's a wall between you and them. But it only works if you stop and take the time to focus your attention. This helps you maintain situational awareness. Try it. <clears throat> so this has started out a little bit different from my last time. Usually this guy is already way over there. And I wouldn't have to wait here. But, um... I don't know. We'll see what happens. I kind of already had a plan. But that's cool. I like the challenge. I want him to get him get inside there and then I'm gonna go ahead and take a shot at him. Take a right. Should take a right. And there he goes. Oh, that was an accident. Okay. Things are not going to plan. Yeah, 
And you learn new things every day you play this. So don't do what I did. Don't run into things because I they have sound. They can hear. <laughs> if you do this right, he should just stay over there. And you don't have to waste 30 seconds like I did. You hear about the special ships guys have been pulling at the old prison area the past two weeks? Yeah, some high value prisoners or something. You get that duty and kiss your break time goodbye, man. My buddy was crying on my shoulder about it. That place has been dead for years. Now we got these, I don't know who's bringing in enemy combatants from states. Right. And the CO is tearing his hair out. I feel like I'm living in a prison. <clears throat> so now they're gonna get out of here. Feel free to use what I'm doing as a guide because I've done it more than once and it seems to always work. I always mark enemies. Always get to know where your enemy's gonna be at. Don't run up too fast here, though. Okay. Not exactly how I wanted to get on that thing, but whatever. Now go when he's not shining the light on you. You should have to take care of this guy, at least I do right here <clears throat> same for the head in the, way. the leader have to go around or deal with him CQC is effective for dealing with nearby enemies it's that easy Make sure you hide his body. Hide bodies because they can be found. For all you newbies at Metal Gear Solid. I'm sure the pros already know. Okay, I don't think it's going to let me look up here. I'm just going to stand up. Listening in on those soldiers. Even casual chatter could reveal something in a place like this. There's Chico. But where's Paz? That's the old prison area. The targets are there. That's where your targets are. Are those animal cages? That's the old prison area. The targets are there. Took care of him. Usually I take that guy on the left first, but that guy was pretty easy to shoot. So use your own judgment on that part. Chico, it's me. No! No! Go away! Hey, Go hey, away! Get no. off, man! Let me out of here, please! Get off please. me! Get off! Chico, keep it down! Go away! Right over here! Hey! Hey! You gotta let me out! You gotta let me out, Joe! Get off me! Hey. 
I got Chico. That boss? Not here. Are you sure? Pretty sure. Is Chico able to walk? Hold on. Not gonna happen. You'll have to carry him out there. Okay, boss, change your plans. Call Chico over to the rendezvous point. We'll get Posse's whereabouts out of him once he's calmed down. <laughs> Alright. So I'm not sure if this is required for the S rank, but I'm you can get these other guys the out. Map. Okay, now carry Chico there. <laughs> and I'm probably gonna... Fast forward uh, this part when I go back for the second guy because you, it's pretty much the same thing when you get them all out. There's going to be some guys here so don't run up right away. There's going to be two. One goes in the hut little building there and another one will stand right there. Just have patience, there's the other one. And shoot when he stops. One down. Who are you? And then that's it. I might edit this out or I might not, I don't know. Just leave him there, go back for the other three. There should be four. I think it's four of the uh, <clears throat> other guys other than Chico. And then I usually go last for Chico, and then um, that's it. Head first in the ocean. You can sprint, I don't think any other guys come. If they do, then well, this game must be pretty random then. Because I haven't encountered it. There's someone in there. What do you plan on doing? And it's as simple as that, guys. Probably gonna make a part two of this. I don't think I'm gonna put the entire mission in one video because it might be a hour long video. I'm not trying to do a speedrun or anything. I'm, I really don't care about speedruns. I've never really been into that. But um, just by doing what I've done now, I got the S rank. And that's pretty much... Basically, I'm just trying to show you all how to get the S rank. And I'm showing you all the game at the same time. Because I don't think I've put a video of this game up. And I'm a Metal Gear Solid fan, so that'd be nice. That's fine if he has some intel, I guess. The only reason I would think I wouldn't get an S rank is if somehow, like, make bumping into those boxes got me, uh, 
counted against me for some reason, but I don't think it does. I never alerted him. But just key to this type of game is have a lot of situational awareness. Don't run into things. And you'll be alright. <coughs> Memorize the the route patterns. This is on normal difficulty, hard may vary, I'm pretty sure. Either that or the enemy senses are probably much more better. They'll probably hear and see a lot better. Alright, so we're gonna go for the last one, and then we get Chico. These guys shouldn't wake up. They stay, they stay asleep for a long while. Maybe on hard, maybe they wake up faster, I have no idea. I think they have done it before, but maybe it's like back in the day when I played it on hard. Because it's been a while since I played this. I had sold it, but then it was free on uh, for PlayStation Plus members, so I downloaded it. Just to play it again, because, I mean, it's fun. It's a nice little tease. People just complain because they charge a little bit too much for it, which I agree with. Can you give me a fall? <clears throat> but right now it's free on the PlayStation Store for PlayStation Plus members, so if y'all want to try it out, go for it. Let's go get Chico. And then when we're on our way to the next part, I'll uh, I'll go ahead and stop it. And part two will be next. And then the chopper will come. You can already kind of see it over there, the red. <clears throat> or at least I can. I don't know how it's going to look on YouTube. It's a really beautiful game. Look at this. I'm moving the camera real nice and slow for y'all.
this! On your feet. Okay. Chico was taken out of his cage. Did he leave the tape recording while he was being moved? Paz might be up ahead. I hear vehicles. And a flag. Must be near the heliport. Might sound wrong, but... Chico left the tape on record while he was being moved. Try using what you hear to find Paz. If you're still not sure, listen to the tape again. Alright guys, I'll see you all in the second part. Hope you all are enjoying so far. So, thanks for watching. I'll see you in the next part.